Hey there, it's Jasper from Presley here today with a video all about Cision's pricing. Now, as you can see on my screen, we do have a full write-up on the topic. If you'd like to read everything that we've discovered about Cision's pricing, I definitely recommend checking it out. All you need to do is Google Cision pricing and you should see a show right up. Now, for the sake of this video, to keep everything a bit more straightforward, I'm just gonna go through the main takeaways of what Cision's pricing looks like, kind of explain all the different aspects of their pricing. Uh, before I do get into it though, it is worth noting that Cision keeps their pricing fully under wraps and hidden. If you wanna get exact prices on how much Cision will cost you specifically for your needs, uh, you'll need to reach out to their sales team and really go through the process of getting a custom quote created. But if you're a bit earlier in the stage of just trying to identify if Cision's ballpark price is right for you, then this video will be super helpful in helping you understand generally what Cision will cost you and your team, depending on the plans you pick. So uh, like I said before, getting into it, I'm going to go through all the different um, categories of Cision's pricing and just explain those one by one and what we've discovered the pricing generally looks like for each of those. So the first one here is their PR platform. And by PR platform, we mean Cision's full suite of different tools they have to help PR teams. So things like their pitching software, their press release tools, media monitoring, all those different tools are baked into one platform. And through our research, we found that generally it starts at around $7,200 per year per user. Uh, so that's a starting price, right? So it, it does go up from there. Um, but from our research, we found that you're looking in the ballpark around $7,200 per user per year as a starting price just for access to that platform. Uh, next up, we have press release distribution. So if you do want to distribute press releases through a wire with uh, Cision, you do have the option to do that. It does cost extra per news release, though. And that starts at $110 per news release and then goes up depending on how advanced you want your release to be, right? So if you just want a very basic, simple news release, you're looking at that lower $110 per release price. But if you want the most premium news release, you're looking at prices all the way up to $455 per news release. So again, you need to pay for the PR platform separately. And then if you want to start distributing through the platform, then you would need to pay per release. So then next up, we have their journalist database. So that is the database that you pay for, for access to all the different media contacts that they have. Um, and that would give you access to all those contacts so you can reach out to them and try to get coverage with them. So Cision is known for having the largest journalist database on the market. So this is really kind of their unique area where they're mostly well known for and most established in. Um, and so the pricing for that database is roughly around $5,700 to $6,000 per year, give or take. Um, what I would say as a disclaimer around journalist databases, as well as press release distribution, is that they do follow a more traditional spray and pray approach to PR that maybe about 10, 15 years ago was a bit more effective, but nowadays really only works for very established brands who already have brand recognition. So when people see an email coming from them, they already have a familiarity with them and they might be more willing to cover them. Though for your average company and your smaller PR team, the spray and pray approach is a little bit difficult to sustain over time to get real results from uh, because most of the time they just kind of fall under the radar. Um, as you can see with these journalist databases, people are actively paying for access to the same journalist contacts, which means that those exact journalists are getting emails from hundreds and hundreds of different companies who are paying for Cision every day. So um, if you are a bit more established, this could still be a nice solution for you. It also makes sense because it is a bit more expensive than other solutions. But if you're just getting started with your PR efforts, we wouldn't necessarily recommend using these journalist databases. They also, there is a bit of an ethical debate. They might not necessarily be GDPR compliant. So that coupled with the fact that they don't work very well in today's PR landscape uh, makes it a bit hard to suggest really investing this amount of money into those. Uh, next up, what we would suggest that might be a little bit more useful for you is a tool that Cision recently acquired, which is called Connectively. It used to be called Help of a Reporter Out. And the whole idea of this is that journalists will actually post different stories that they're looking for more information on. And you can reach out to those journalists with more information, share different articles and stories you've written, different press releases of yours, and hopefully in exchange get coverage. Um, so Connectively is great to try out because you can start with 10 pitches every month for free. And then if you find that it's working for you and you are getting results, you can always invest and you can go all the way up to 150 pitches a month for $150 a month. So a lot of value in there for a very fair price. That's kind of the last pricing aspect of Cision that we'll go over here. Now, Cision does have other tools in their suite. They have other acquisitions they've made. Though for the standard PR team, these are kind of all the different areas of Cision that we really looked into and did a lot of research for on pricing. Um, so kind of wrapping it up here, right? Is Cision right for you? Is this pricing good for you? I think there's really two categories to think of, right? One is the very clear one, budget. Uh, does your team have a large enough budget to sustain something like $7,200 per user per year? 
um, as well as all the different prices, right? $6,000 per year for a database. That all adds up very quickly. So the first question to ask yourself is, does it match your budget? The second one is, does it match your strategy, right? As I mentioned before, there are two kind of strategies you can follow today with digital PR. One is that more traditional spray and pray approach that we're finding isn't very effective for most PR teams nowadays. And the other is a bit more of an authentic relationship building approach, coupled with also trying to reach out to uh, people across different platforms, right? So not just traditional journalists, but also influencers and people maybe who have a more active following online that wouldn't necessarily call themselves influencers. So um, if you do have that high budget and you want the more traditional approach, Cision is a great choice. Uh, now, if you are looking for something a bit lower budget and you do want to take that more updated relationship-based PR approach, we would recommend trying out Presley. Uh, so Presley starts at only $110 a month. Um, we do have a bit more of a modern approach on PR, a bit more relationship driven. You can see here that we focus really deeply on individual contacts um, and it only starts at $110 a month, but we also have a 14 day free trial that you can sign up for uh, without even needing a credit card. So what we always say to people is give Presley a shot for 14 days. If you like it, you can sign up. If not, you can always reach out to Cision Sales Team, try to nail down a more uh, specific price. All right, I hope this was helpful. If you have any questions, if there's any way we can improve this video, this article, anything we can do to give you more advice on the PR software landscape in general and pricing and features and usage around that, definitely let us know. We wanna be as helpful as we can. And otherwise, hope you have a great day. Thanks, bye.